Somebody say, I gave my life to Christ. Oh, yes, you did, but God drew you. If he had not drawn you, you wouldn't be nearby. No man can come to me except the Father draws him. Except the Father draws him. Except the Father draws him. Oh, Lord, thank you for drawing me to yourself. Thank you for not leaving me to myself. Thank you for not leaving me to stray and go the way of the world. Somebody may be very confused and say, oh, if God draws me before I came to him, then why will he judge those who don't come to him? It's very, very simple. God knows those who will respond to his pool. When he said, Jacob have I loved, Esau have I hated, even while they were yet in the womb of, his, of their mother, he knew the possibilities of Esau, the tendencies and the proclivities that have not yet manifested. He saw it ahead. Am I communicating at all? He saw it ahead. That's why at times you wonder why you and somebody had the same gospel, but the person refused to change. There are tendencies in him that is resistant to God. But above all, Lord, you saw my heart and you pulled me to yourself and you made me accepted in the beloved blessed be your name how many of you know it's a luxury it's a luxurious thing to be called the child of god you, I, I don't know how the people of the world are feeling those who don't know god in in the season we are in in this nation and globally the uncertainty of the world it is a terrible thing miserable thing to be away from God. We thank him. For being accepted in the beloved. Beloved. It doesn't matter who does not love you. If God loves you. The most important person is the one loving you. Somebody say a loud amen. Somebody say, say the loudest amen. Say.